Hello everyone, this is me, Sadia here, and I'm back with another bonus love read. This reading is going to be for the sign of Aries. Topic of the reading for you guys is, um, for all of you out there who really want to end up with the specific someone that you really love, but you don't know if that's ever going to happen or not, this reading will definitely help you know the answer to the question. Will the two of you end up together or not? I will be adding oracle cards in this reading as well, so stay tuned. We, will, or we might also add some charms in the read as well. So stay tuned and before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it's a general read. It may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. So always pick the signs and messages that resonate and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's dive into the read and let's find out Aries. Will the two of you end up together? Yes or no? Let's see whoever it is that you're checking this read for. Let's see, will you end up with this person? Three of Cups, Page of Wands, Five of Pentacles. Wow. I feel like you know the, the two of you enjoy the connection that you have with them, but at the same time, um, I feel like, you know, um, I really don't see the chances of the two of you ending up together. And in the deck, we do have the Seven of Cups. Maybe there is a lot of issues. Maybe there is a lot of uh, differences coming in, the, uh, coming in the situation for the two of you. Um, I feel like, you know, for majority of you, the connection that you have with this person might have started off very good. Like, you know, you might have had the best time with this person. Um, you know, maybe right now, too, you are having that perfect time with this person. But at the same time, I really don't see this uh, situation getting better here. Um, I feel like, you know, for the majority of you, uh, this person might choose something else over you or you might have to kind of like, you know, uh, choose something else over them. I really see that situation is not going to get favorable for the two of you in this connection. Um, it can be coming from your end as well. Maybe your family is not going to get, uh, you know, uh, get them approved and, uh, you know, allow you to get married to this person or allow the two of you to be together. Maybe there are going to be other differences coming into play as well. But I really don't see this connection going next level. For majority of you, I feel like, you know, um, this this situation uh, with this person is is like you know um I feel like you know you, probably you want it to happen maybe they also want it to happen but the the efforts that are required I really don't see those effort you know being put in the situation so I feel like you know if you both want to get married to each other situation can be worked out but I really don't see that working out to be honest like you know it's it's more like I really feel like you know with with ace of cups and the sun I feel like you know yes there is a possibility for it to happen but the needs uh, this needs some sort of effort being put in the connection which I really don't see coming in for 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 the for the connection now again the issues can be coming from your end the issues can be coming from your person's end as well but things are not heading the right direction for sure and I feel like you know you will be um, you know, finding it very hard to make things work in this connection. Um, but yes, if, if you continue having, you know, the kind of connection that you have, which is going to be perfect, it can last that way. But if you want to ask, like, you know, will the two of you end up together? I really don't see that. Now, for some of you, you could be dealing with a, with an extramarital affair or a, an extra affair other than your current person. Maybe you your person has another person in their life. So there could be a third party situation involved here as well. Maybe they are going to stay married to the, another person and then they could, uh, like, you know, stay with you as well. But I really don't see the two of you together and nobody between the two of you i really don't see that working out so maybe that could be the reason why your person is not gonna like you know choose to commit or choose to give into the connection with you but um i feel like you know if you continue having what you have with this person it will be perfectly fine but i really don't see the connection being um in the right direction for sure um uh, let's see what is the oracle guidance for you right now in the given situation um wow this this seems like you know i feel like you know there could be or there would be a big time uh, third party situation affecting this connection and uh, stopping it from moving towards a new you know in uh, towards the right uh, direction where the two of you could end up together um let's see um I feel like, you know, uh, the divine really wants you to make some plans to go about this connection and then follow those plans as well. Like, you know, focus on them and try to make things work. I really feel like, you know, with these two cards, I said the same thing. If you really want to make it work, you can definitely make it work. But at the same time, 
to be honest like you know the energies that i pick up coming in for you i really don't see the two of you putting your foot into the connection to make it work um grow within your current situation i feel like and for majority of you it's just a karmic thing or it's just a lesson that you have to learn from this connection and then you have to move forward to a better future with another person i really feel like you know this person is not something that you're going to end up with um i feel like you know you 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 will probably be the one to give up on the connection because the person might not give you what you want with them maybe they are not going to leave the third party maybe they are going to be like you know okay fine we can stay together like this uh, but I cannot commit to you. Maybe they are going to say something like that because I really don't see things working out for you in your in your connection with this person. You will have to either, uh, you know, uh, at last kind of like, you know, give up on the situation for majority of you. But yeah, let's see um, what else is the oracle guidance for you. What else is the oracle guidance for you? Call to action. Take charge. Lead by example. Walk your talk. I feel like, you know, for the majority of you, um, you are going to take the action to separate yourself from this person. I don't know why I'm picking up this that energy more than anything else here. Um, karma releasing, move beyond drama, create your own path, make room for good energy. I feel like, you know, you will be walking away from this person and this situation because I really don't see this person giving you what you want uh, or, you know, what you even deserve. I feel like, you know, this person could be taking you for granted. Um, they could be like, you know, t keeping you as an option or as a, as, a, as a second thing for them. They are not like, you know, valuing you. And I feel like, you know, the divine really wants you to take stand for yourself here and, uh, uh, try to release this uh, you know connection because this is nothing more than a karmic relationship that you got yourself into for some reasons but yes just learn from the experience and move forward uh, never settle in for less than what you deserve and desire and I feel like you know for majority of you you could have settled in for way too less than uh, what you actually expected or actually you know wished for or prayed for so I feel like you know yes you are not gonna be like you know um Ending up together with this person. Let me take some charms around the situation that you are dealing with. Let's see the charms here. So we do have Ace of Pentacles and Ace of Swords. I feel like you, know, you will be getting married or uh, committed or engaged to a new person. And everything is going to happen so quick. It's not going to take long. It's just going to happen so fast, so quick that you will be surprised to. Like, you know, you are going to be dealing with a breakup when this new person would come into your life. So I feel like, you know, there is going to be a lot of... Uh, new energy entering in your love life and the divine really wants you to open yourself up to that you might be getting uh, pregnant in the very beginning of the relationship as well and i feel like you know this is some somebody new for sure it's not going to be the same person alphabets we have b q y h f e v and k so this could be be your name initial name initial of the person that you are dealing with but i really see that um for majority of you you are not gonna be ending up with this person and in fact somebody new would be walking into your life and like you know making things work for you in your favor i feel like you know it's um there is a beautiful energy coming in for you in your love life and i feel like you know the one that you are currently dealing with that is going to be washed away uh why you know by the heavens and now uh, you will be presented by a beautiful opportunity to have the kind of love life that you always desired of uh, so yeah that's pretty much just coming up for you for this read if it was of help do like and subscribe till i do the next read for you guys take care bye